Hey folks, Shonen Jack back again with uh, another one of these live reactions. I'm just gonna keep trying these out, keep experimenting with it, see how it goes. Uh, so, well, trying one or two of these. And next up, we're going with Attack on Titan Season 2. Uh, I have not thought about Attack on Titan in a long time. Like, I think. The last time I paid it any mind was going to a panel at a convention that involved a uh, Attack on Titan themed uh, pen and paper roleplay. And that was kind of interesting, but that was basically just using the setting of the world and had nothing to do with the plot. Uh, I have no idea what's coming up in season two, outside of like what's been in the PVs. I've been spoiled on one or two major reveals that are upcoming, but I've mostly been able to avoid um, as much of this stuff as possible. So, uh, well, I'm expecting like the usual wit studio, like action and Spider-Man uh, swinging through the cities and more weird, weird Titan designs. But uh, we'll, we'll see how uh, Attack on Titan handles season two, how it uh, gets us back in after four very long years. I didn't play. Yeah, there's that uh, very intense music all over again. And the very intense, like, highly detailed eyes. Hi, Annie. All right, so we're picking, picking up right after the ending. And there's... Sleeping Beauty. Not much you can do about that until you find a way to get her out of there. I guess like, hmm. How don't you just think of something? Dissolving in acid. That's what they should try. Hey. Peeking out of the wall, aren't you? I remember that image. I, I took a screen cap at the end of the first season and just put, see you next year. And that was... I am not... I should not be a betting man. Yeah. Oh. It's not possible that there was just one there. It's gotta be all along the whole thing. What do you know about this? Hey, new opening. Hmm. Key to the basement that we're never making it to. This has gotta be by the same band, right? Because it's, it's very similar to Guren no Yumina. Hmm. What's going on here? We got some Titans fighting each other. We've got a bit of focus on uh, the Yuri couple. And Hanji and Aaron and Levy, which are already pretty prominent characters. And the baby arm for some reason. Okay. I don't recall if there was this much um, CG in the original, in the last season. What's the, what's the through line here? All beating hearts full of blood? Okay, number 26. So that's how numbering is going to work. We're going to pretend nothing happened between now and four years ago. Yeah. Yeah, covering up the sun, uh, covering up the wall titan from the sun makes sense, because that's a thing that they did last season with, like, Hanji's, ex Hanji's pair of experimental titans, was kept them out of the sunlight and kept them covered up and they would be very lethargic. But, uh, man, what, what if this wall titan breaks out? I guess this was a private op, and they're going to cover it up. Cover it all up? Oh, just with blankets? They don't even have a sheet big enough. Start talking, mf -er. You have talking to do, not work to do. Mm-hmm. Works for me! Effing drop him. I don't think I've seen her that angry before. Oh. Nice rotational shot. Cool bit of animation. Most people are ready to die for their cause and keep their Illuminati secrets. Oh, she's shaking too, just a little bit. Yeah, that's got that's gotta be frightening. That's that's bad. I forget which what the order is. But Wall Rose. That's gotta be the second wall, right? Because it's Wall Maria, Wall Rose, and Wall. I don't know. That explains that Wall Cena. Sasha's back! Best girl. 
You're never gonna be normal. I wouldn't expect Kony to be that intelligent from what uh, we saw from... Were they like in hiding because of the secret op? There we go. Was it Sasha? Oh. I, I thought we were... I thought we were going for a gag. There are likely no titans. Oh. Right, because they, they know people can become heightens now. So they're suspicious of all their own recruits. Oh. We're not going to get a 3D maneuver here. Oh, from the south, where his village was. Cool. Alright, there's some 3D maneuver here. Oh, the wacky Titan designs get me every time. I'm trying to think what that little guy would, reminds me of. Mr. Potato Head? Probably some politician. Maybe like Mr. Bean. Just a little bit. It's strange to see these two volunteering, because they were the two that were freaking out at the when fighting Titans before. Mm. Always with the intense stares. There's not going to be anything there, Connie. It feels like the first time I've he heard that character speak. They've been giving their all for a long time. Repeatedly. And flipping the fu- Fua! It's, it's unusual for Titans to sprint like that, isn't it? That was like, usually just the abnormal thing? Or the aberrant? Oh. Never seen these characters before. At all. I don't like their chances. Second only to Levy. That's that's quite the build-up. Let's, let's pause here for a quick second so I can read the writing. Alright, so that's about the material of the wall. So, well, the walls have been broken before, so clearly the, uh, the crystal around the female titan can be broken too. No, no uh, second part to that. But the other catches are always interesting because they're packed with information, even if it's just weird, like... That one weird short story about the hole that kept disappearing when they tried to dig under the wall. Hey, it's our main character that nobody likes. They're gonna repeat her uh, death, aren't they? Okay, fine. We're spared that uh, that pain, but we're away from the action. Why? Hey, Amy Costa. It really is a surprise that that uh, scarf has survived multiple Titans attacks. What are these three going to do about it? Yeah, eh, he's not gonna. There's what, nine of these guys? And one of him? Mm hmm. And we're pinning our hopes on him? Mm hmm. That, time, that one time's like, draw me like one of your French girls. Mm. There's a big fella. Very, very skinny arms. So that's the one in all of the PVs. What's it after? Oh no. Oh no. Not the horse. Not the pony. Oh. Okay. So instead of humans at once, animals. Is that it? Oh. And it starts. Mata? Who said that? that? That's a very gentle face for a not gentle. Oh. Oh. So. It speaks, and not even, like, in a dumb, like, caveman English. It's, like, pretty decent sentences. We have an intelligent titan. A very hairy intelligent titan. I wonder how intelligent it actually is. Oh, your poor legs. We reside, reside in the nape? What do they mean, we? Is that, like, the other titan humans that are... In the nape of the neck? Is there a human inside that big old titan? Even if it's not a civilized person? He's trying to psych himself up with his own words? That seems like a mistake. The right thing to do seems to not do that. Well, if he's going the other way, it should be fine, right? Oh. No one can ever look dignified in, in their death. Where are you going, big guy? Oh, just... Just let him stop. Oh. You lived too long. Oh. Okay. And there's some Beauty and the Beast shit going on in the ending titles, so... Uh, three dot. 
hey, cannibalism. We heard a bit about that in the first season. Those titans all looked very tall. Were they like all the heightedly colossal titan? Yeah, I suppose that's the only silver lining is we haven't seen the colossal titan this episode. Outside of flashback. There's some weird stuff going on in this ending. Like, seems to apply like an ongoing relationship between the titans and humans. Like that they didn't suddenly appear. There's a cowboy. I'm home. That is not going to go well. I don't think you want to be home, Sasha. So, first episode of the new season. It's feeling pretty good about that. We're getting back into the excitement, and there's already stuff happening. And people dying. And it's it's getting back into that uh, feeling of the first season from the like aesthetic sense of just the oppressive intensity and, like, sense of dread that you feel the entire time through where it's just like this is going to go badly people are going to die and it's going to include your favorites and also jobbers like this guy because he was built up just enough just like yeah we we need him to hold them off we need to pin our hopes on this guy and let's immediately dash those hopes in true attack and titan fashion so uh, well, yeah, it's back. I'm looking forward to the next episode, and we should be getting the simul dub in a couple weeks, and that'll be worth, you know, that'll be worth a look. I, I may end up uh, watching both or watching just the one. I haven't decided yet. Uh, haven't decided when you're next going to see me either. So this e- idea to edit the episode and live reactions down is a bit time consuming. It's not as easy as just, like, record, slap the footage together, and upload it all in one go, Uh, even if it takes less rendering time. But, uh, yeah, let me know what you thought of the video down below, and if you want to see more of these and like the way that I've got it set up, uh, if I am make if there's something I'm drastically overlooking that would improve the whole thing, let me know. Uh, But... I'll catch you next time. See ya.